who had been unwell last week and obviously affected their preparation. The wind was really gusty, but Frazier was playing remarkably well. Two breaks, four love. She held a serve. To go five love. Pick it up in the sixth game. Frazier still ruling the roost. All the power that we expected from the German coming the other side of the net. Huber now facing set point. 30 40, love five. Scarcely credible, and an upset looking very much on the cards. A whitewash first set for the American. Move into the second set. The wind, as you can see, still gusting. But now at last, Huber poised for a game. 15.40. And that's what she'd been waiting for. But immediately, Frazier broke back. One game each. And now it's break point. Huber for a second break. Or her second. So the first three games going against serve. Hooper broke again to lead 5-2 and serving now at 40-15 to level up. And now with the momentum totally in her favour, she went into the deciding set a decided favourite. She picked up the third set in strong style. Hooper broke in the opening game. And here, it's 3-1. then to 4-3. Just when Huber looked to have it won, Frazier was pushing her all the way. Yeah. Winners out of nowhere. 4-1. With two breaks, he was back at 4 all. to five all again with two more breaks it's love 40 and another break point Huber Huber taking it so five out of six games are gone against serve at that stage Huber at 6-5 serving for the match What a battle it had been. But Anka Huber had survived. The finalist from last year. They're going to be to Kajita Martinez and Amanda Kurtz.